welcome back to my channel today's video is a tradition i do on this channel i think this is my third time making this video today i am doing my what's in my backpack video for 2018 to 2019 usually what's in my backpack videos are more like back to school supplies hauls so that's what i'm doing most of the stuff is going to be in my pencil case or my locker not everything is in my backpack all the time so i'm just calling it a what's in my backpack but honestly it's like more of a back to school supplies haul video but if you're not already subscribed make sure to subscribe because i have a bunch of upcoming super exciting videos that you don't want to miss out on as well as go follow my instagram it's just hey it's ainsley very aesthetically pleasing feed if you enjoy those types of feeds make sure to go follow it and yeah so let's just get on to the video all right so it's a what's in my backpack video i feel like we should sort of start off with my backpack so this is it this year it's a please stand by while i try to pronounce it feed jar lee raven konkin i just call it a konkin bag but i'm pretty sure it's swedish and i got this one it's a sort of sky blue more like a tealy gray and i liked it a lot because it's not that light that it will get stained super easily but it's still not super super dark it's sort of in the medium and it's super super cute and like i feel like these bags are really trendy and i can see why they're super cute and there's just a front pocket and then on the inside there's just so so much room in it and then there's just a back pocket but yeah, this is the bag. It's super big and it's going to carry all the supplies that I'm about to show you. To start off with binders, I'm not quite sure what binders I'm going to need for what classes yet. So I'm just going to be reusing some binders that I've used in the past. And these are binders that I think I'll be needing. But I'm just going to bring them and probably use them. So the first one is just, I feel this might have been in my first back to school haul video. I'll link it down below. It's very cringy from two years ago. So if you want to go watch it, don't. But it's just a one and a half inch binder and it's bright pink because I feel like my personality would be this color if personalities had a color if that makes any sense but um yeah so i'm gonna use this i'm pretty sure for most of my subject and then i just have two other small one inch binders this one's in black because it's for music because i'm a part of my school band and i just have all the fingerings for the flute on the front because sometimes i forget it Oops. and then i just have a white one inch binder in case i need it I, I used this last year for a subject and it worked great because that's what their binders are meant for. So yeah, I just have this white binder. And then to go inside a binder, obviously you're going to need paper. So I just picked up two packs of 100 sheet paper. They were each like 25 cents each, which I sort of thought was a really good deal because there were other paper brands that were like four bucks for 100 sheets. But I can't tell the difference between sort of like 25 cent paper and the four dollar paper so i just picked up the cheap kind of paper so i have lots of that and hopefully that will last me the whole year and then i just picked up this five star two pocket folder which has tabs and all this stuff i'm not sure if i'm gonna need this i'll probably need it for drama to put scripts and stuff in it but i just picked it up and once again it's sort of in a bright teal color almost like my backpack but way 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 brighter so i just picked up this folder and then um i bought this last year for my back to school supplies haul video but i never ended up using it and i just found it in my room and i thought i could use it this year so it's just a three subject five star notebook which has the three subjects as that's what it's meant for and it's just in this black color so so it's just some extra paper and if i want to organize notes and stuff i can use this and then that's sort of all the paper binder boring stuff so now is sort of the what's in my pencil case sort of section and all the stationery so to start off with my pencil case it's just this bright tropical pencil case once again very bright colors but i've been using this this might be my fourth year using it and i'm like the only reason i'm still using it is because it works it has two pockets which i really like and i can and it's very very sturdy and i haven't been able to find a different pencil case that's sort of like this one so this one is four years strong and i'll be using it again this year and sort of a necessity for school are pens last year i got 
these like very fancy bougie gel pens and they were very pricey and very expensive luxurious pens but I didn't really like them I just really wanted to get sort of a generic basic pens and these were like a 20th of the price they're just the big crystal smooth pens and it comes in an assortment of colors which mostly has blue but I only write in black ink and I couldn't find any just all black pens so there's two black pens in here and the blue pens I just still don't know what I'm gonna do with yet but yeah I just got a bunch of pencils did I just say pencils I meant pens and for pencils this is the sort of only brand of pencils I like because I have the white erasers and I really like blue pencils not because of the color I just find that they break less and they write better if that makes any sense at all but yeah there's not much to explain other than their pencils and then highlighters these are the Bic brand. I usually go for the Sharpie brand, but they didn't have any. But I'm assuming that they're going to work the exact same because they're just generic highlighters. And then I just got a calculator. I know, super exciting. But it's just a scientific one because the one I've been using for the past couple years broke. So I decided to get a new one and it's just a plain black one in... Yeah, it's just a calculator. And then the last two things in my, what's in my backpack is just this water bottle. Um, I got it from Costco in a pack of three so I can share with my sister, but I just picked out this dark blue color and I really like these water bottles. Um, but yeah, so it's just a water bottle. And then finally, I just have this pack of gum that I'm gonna put in the front of my pocket because I love having gum at school school and yeah cut it's it's gum but yeah that's basically it for what's in my backpack this year it's not as complicated as the past two years which i once again link down below if you're interested but i really enjoy everything i have this year for back to school so i hope you guys enjoyed watching this week's video make sure to like comment and subscribe and i will see you next week for another video bye